Now, there are a range of key concepts that you need to be aware of as we explore digital culture and its impact upon education. So these are defined and I've provided you with a reading that explores the particular concept in greater detail if you have a particular interest in that concept. But regardless of that, you should be aware, at least at a basic level, of what each of these concepts involve. So that as we engage with discussion around digital culture and education, you can participate fully in that discussion in an informed way. So these concepts involve things such as digital technologies, network communications, participatory culture, media convergence, digital identity, cultural transformation, digital citizenship, e-learning, digital literacy and education, and technology integration in pedagogy, and the digital divide in education, and online learning communities. So each of these concepts brings part of our understanding of digital culture and its impact upon education into greater resolution as we approach digital culture from a whole range of different angles and build out our complex understanding of what's involved. Now, some areas you're going to be particularly interested in, get into the readings, do other readings, find out as much as you can about that so that you can really contribute around that topic in the discussions. For other topics, just skim the readings, look at the contents, look at the basic summaries, and get a general idea of what's involved with that concept so that at least you can participate and engage with the discussion around that topic, even if it's not something that you're particularly focused on. Now, in Teams, share your thoughts about one of these key concepts in regards to digital culture and education.